Sunburn, hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is your favorite lady, Lady T. And you know what? This is the right place to be. To all my returning subscribers, thank you for your loyalty. Thank you for your love. Because without you guys, I do not have a channel. And to all the newbies, I'm giving you three seconds now to subscribe, subscribe, and to subscribe. And to all the guys that have been sending love and comments, guys, I will get time and respond to all your comments. It doesn't mean which I haven't been seeing them. I have been seeing the comments. And thank you for taking that time thank you for clicking on my channel and thank you for everything and today's video is basically based on this comment that i got which i also want to become an au pair how do i go about the process so stay tuned watch and enjoy the video so basically i'll be sharing my process of how i became an au pair how did i apply for this au pair the process behind everything first thing that i did was i enrolled at a language school what do i mean a language school in order to become an au pair in austria you have to have basic knowledge of german language that is basically like the foundation of german language so that's what i did i enrolled at a language school in Albert in south africa in johannesburg and i started attending the course the course was actually was it may june it was one month yes the course was one month and basically in the course you'll be learning how to say good morning how to introduce yourself um and everything all the basic stuff the basic knowledge that you have to learn that you have to know in order to communicate in german that was the first course but that was the first step but guys um this german um classes schools are everywhere so you can either decide to do an online course or you can do a physical course i mean I, in my case i did i opted for the physical course because there was a school nearby but if you want a list of schools okay i'll just write a list of schools below but the most common school that i know is goethe institute and it's everywhere be it in zimbabwe be it in south africa be it in kenya be it in new wherever there is got goethe institute so you can just check that up and the second step after enrolling in a language school and passing that exam and getting that a1 certificate because it's called r eins certificate after getting that r eins certificate then i had to start the journey of looking for a firm Family. looking for a family there are also two options you can either use an agency or you can also use the internet because guys like technology technology so using an agency you basically have to pay them and the agency will help you in finding a family in europe but be aware just make sure that the agency that you're using you're recommended by someone but mostly most agencies are actually valid and legit and everything but in my case i didn't use an agency because there was no agency that was helping au pairs and finding um families in Ulster Reich. so i had to opt for finding a family on my own who the journey so there are actually websites as well there is au pair.com as well as au pair world and all other agencies but basically today i'll talk about the two that i'm familiar with opair.com and opair world with opair world i followed in on op, opening a profile it was giving me um um funny funny messages on how i cannot open a profile and everything so i ended up using opair.com Com. opening a profile guys it's as easy as drinking water don't forget to stay hydrated guys it's hot yo mm so in opair.com right i had to open a profile opening a profile you include all your details your name your surname where you where, where you were born uh, when do you want to start the opair program up until when um the ages of the kids that you want to take care of um do you have a driver's license are you going to be able to live with a single parent be it the father or the mother um are you going to be able to take care of kids basically you're choosing you're selecting the preferences of the au pair family that you would like to have right and then after that you have to write a small and a motivational letter on why you want to become an au pair and um, i want to become an au pair simply because i love children and i also want to become an au pair because i want to better my dodge i want to become an au pair so that i can experience the europe culture you just have to write any reason like any valid reason on why you want to become an au pair in austria basically your motivation it has to be that it has to have that thing which when someone is reading it they'll be confused they'll be convinced that yeah for sure this person is the right is the right candidate right and then after the motivational um briefing writing that you have to do after that you have to upload pictures uploading pictures you don't just take selfies in jay um, standing in front of the house or 
take selfies a uh, licking ice cream no 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 pictures with kids pictures that involve kids either playing with kids if you've got siblings this is the time to start bonding with your siblings take pictures with those Moranina siblings i'm um, either feeding them or just playing with them by the park anything to show that you are that active that you are that energetic person and you like kids other people they even got to as far as hiring a photographer and you go to the park and you take professional pictures with kids on swings and everything do you my friend do you do what you see is best for you as long as it's pictures that involve kids and then after the pictures you have to after that what's the next thing or well, after that you start after after the profile has been activated on opet.com there are also uh, multiple ways of activating the opet.com um, profile mina i use the no subscription method because i didn't want to pay any money but you can also pay and by paying you become a premium member and becoming a premium member that means you can actually access all types of families and you can send as many messages and view as many profiles that you want but mina i didn't pay anything i just was the free member a uh, subscriber so yeah after that i had to start to look for a family looking for a family firstly i was looking for a family in germany and then after i realized that the embassy has got problems and everything a second time i then opted for looking for a family in austria so i was now looking for a family in austria germany switzerland and everything i didn't narrow down my options like wherever i was going to get a family it was basically okay with me because with dutch you can either with the dutch language you can either be an au pair in germany you can be an au pair in switzerland and switzerland and Schwarz, like switzerland you can be an au pair in Österreich and I forgot the other country, but yeah. So I mean, my in my search, I was looking for families in Germany, Switzerland, order Austria. I was just like, okay, whatever, wherever country that I go to, it's okay as long as it's not here. And then I just write messages to families on a daily basis. On a daily basis, I think I was contacting thirty, if not twenty, families on a day. I'll get some positive um require um I guess I, I will get back some positive responses, but others were also negative. But nonetheless, guys, I just had to persevere because I knew what I wanted. And lastly, I got a family. After getting the family, we started talking on WhatsApp. We did a video call with the mother and the kids and everything. And then after the video call, they sent me the right documents that I have to have, the contract and everything. And then I went to the embassy and there's also a video that i made on requirements when going to the embassy as an austrian au pair and then after the embassy my visa was given to me i got my visa and after getting my visa and then on my way to austria and right now i am in austria that is the process that i did but first step look for a language school that is the first step look for a language school i'll write down a few schools that i know and if you're interested you can check them up contact them and start talking to them but anyway guys the sky is the limit whatever that you set your mind on you can definitely do it thank you for watching my videos and do not forget to continue sharing the channel do not forget to subscribe and do not forget to like i'm out of here welcome I'm even saying we'll come back. I'm out of here and thank you for watching. Till we meet again next week. Bye-bye. Cheers.